Iloilo City, Rabia Mateo, an Ilonga Indian biracial beauty. She grew up in a poor and broken family. Through her mom, she learned the values of forgiveness and hope. She loves their local phrase, Basta Ilonga Guava. Yes, guys, good morning. My name is Farmer Flores, your video reactor. The video that we're going to watch today is a performance of our very own Miss Rebea Mateo who performed Miss Universe Philippines. This video that we're going to watch today is the question and answer portion. This portion of the question is the preliminary questions of all the candidates of the Miss Universe Philippines. Again guys, join me to watch this video and construct your own feedback about the question and answer portion of Miss Rebea Mateo. Sabak yung mga manok ko yun, lakot sa tao eh. <laughs> Hello, good morning. I am Rabia Oxanio Mateo, 23, representing the city of Love, Iliilo. I am biracial. Ay, I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 I introduced myself na. <laughs> I-introduce sa siya si Ian, kung galingan eh. Yes. So, 30 seconds lang. Give an introduction. Tell us something about it. I am actually biracial. My mom is an Ilonga and my dad is an Indian, if you can see through my features. However, I was raised in a broken family and I experienced a really poor life. And I was able to rise from our situation as well because of educating, people, because of educating myself. And now I decided to go give back to my community and I became a lecturer for physical therapy. That's why I was able to Go to. Stalo ka to para mahot don sa oras na dahan pa siya kipang istorya pero mahot don sa oras. Which means beautiful. I feel like we have this um statement in Iloilo basta ilongga guapa. Which means guapa basta ilongga guapa. Basta bisaya guapo. I'm very proud that um with Miss Universe Philippines I was able to bring that kind of aspect that every. Filipino would know that statement, Basta Ilonga Guapa. If there would be one thing that I learned through my mother, that would be always forgive people. Because there's no such thing as a perfect person. And when my dad left us, she never speak ill about him. That's why in every situation, even though other people would hurt me, I still choose to see the goodness in them. I feel you, Rebea. You know what? Even though you're struggling, you can still become the symbol of hope. I myself, um, I had fears, uncertainty, but I still um, realized that I could still give back to Iloilo City. Out of my pocket, I decided to go for the frontliners, and I know that's just a simple way, but that's my best way to help our modern heroes. Being a Miss Universe, you become influential. So I want to go back to my advocacy, which is Feed Me Any Video Program, which we help those children living near the dump site. If you have seen my Beyond the Coastline video, I want to go back there. And we need a lot of materials, learning materials. And I feel like being a Miss Universe, I will be able to pull donors into our project to make it foster even better. Feed Me Any Video Program. What color do you think symbolizes the phenomenal woman? I feel that a phenomenal woman is red because red is power and I am red. True. Um, Sa lalaki naman is blue. Pure heart. So, what do you think are the skills needed to this uh, future workspace or a future uh, workplace of the future? Sorry. As of the moment, I am working from home because we don't have classes, um, live classroom classes. That's why we decided to conduct our lectures online. I feel like nowadays we need to adopt to the situation. So um, we need to be versatile in what is happening around us. And 
online business or working from home is such a huge opportunity for us to spend more time with our family and as well um, trying to enjoy the life. If you can name one spot, man-made or natural, in your uh, in Ilocino City, what would it be? I would definitely want to bring all of you to Haro Cathedral because, you know what, in Iloilo, we don't have much of natural spots. But Haro Cathedral is like an establishment that witnessed the love and devotion that Ilongos have towards God. And I feel like it's been there since the Spanish era. So with timeless memories and modernization, we were able to, you know, arrive to be the Ilongos that we are today. There's a campaign that has love local. You know what? It was also asked to me during Miss Iliila, and I want to bring to the global community our very own hablon, that is our indigenous fabric. And I feel like you know it enriches the culture of not just Iliila but of our country. Every time I wear hablon, I don't just wear Iliila, but I wear Philippines. Now, first of all, what is one thing? Young people like you should focus on. You need to invest in yourself. As of the moment, there's a lot of distractions. There's a lot of bashers or backlash. But at the end of the day, when you practice self-love, you get to know the right weapon in order for you to win life. And I feel like right now, I am right enough to win the competition because I've done everything that I could to transform, to become a phenomenal woman that I am. Whoa, nice. Kaling. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wow, talino, shit. Actually, at first, I was kind of hesitant because you need 30 seconds to answer one question. But in the end, I was able to gain that momentum. And I feel like up until now, there's so much energy in me. Yeah, right, toto. Miss Iloilo City, Rabia Mateo, an Ilonga Indian biracial beauty. She grew up in a poor and broken family. Through her mom, she learned the values of forgiveness and hope. She loves their local phrase, Basta Ilonga Guapa, because she truly is beautiful inside and out. Sure win. Ilo Ilo City, Rabia Mateo. Whoa. Ganda ng babae ito ba? Gorgeous So yun na nga guys, yun na nga yun ang reaction natin kay Ms. Rebe Mateo sa kanyang preliminary questions answer portion and what I want to say is that I was amazed of that question and answer portion. I see the genuine of the heart, the pure heart of Ms. Rabea Mateo. And I'm looking forward na sana she win this competition, this Miss Universe 2020 this coming May. And I hope so na sana she bring the crown of this competition. So ayun na nga guys, kung bago mo ko, please don't forget to like and share this video and click the subscription button for more updated videos. Maraming maraming salamat guys!